Inside a crime caught on tape, a manhunt is underway tonight for a gunman who struck in broad daylight in the middle of a crowded street. A young man killed execution style. Here with the new images, ABC's John Triffin. This is the chilling image just moments before police say a suspected hitman pulled a gun from his pocket and put a bullet into the back of the head of 31-year-old Brandon Lincoln Woodard, a father and aspiring lawyer from Los Angeles. Police are now looking for this man who somehow managed to slip away with more than a dozen witnesses nearby in Manhattan's Columbus Circle. Here's how the calculated murder went down. Police say around 1.20 Monday afternoon, the suspect arrived at the scene waiting for his victim. 30 minutes later, he gets out of the tan getaway car, talks to his getaway driver, and scopes out the scene. Watch as multiple people walk by getting a glimpse of the killer before he pulls his hood up then begins pacing up and down the block, even passes by his target. Minutes later, as Woodard is walking down this busy street with surveillance cameras catching his every move, the suspect walks up from behind. Police say that's when the victim looks up from his phone, instinctively turns around, but decides to keep going. Seconds later, around 2 o'clock, that's when police say the suspect pulled out a silver semi-automatic pistol, firing the fatal shot. The hitman then calmly gets into the passenger side of the getaway car and takes off. Nobody saw him. There were 50 people at least on that corner. Nobody's seen the guy. ABC News has learned Woodard had more than a dozen arrests dating back to 2004. But police say they still don't know why someone wanted him dead. John Schriff in ABC News, New York.